All right, so today I'm just gonna be pulling some blank shots, flushing the system out, and adjusting the pressure stat. In this video, I flushed about two liters of water throughout the whole system. As it heated up, I realized I forgot to put some Teflon tape on the pressure gauge, so I took it apart, redid that, and once I did that, everything was fine, there's no more leaks. So I'm flushing the system out right now. All the water coming out looks nice and clean, which is exactly what I'm looking for. All right. So I have the electric turn on its side here. I'm gonna show you how to adjust the pressure stat. So this little box here, that's the pressure stat. It has a little tube that connects straight to the brew boiler, which goes into this little box and cylinder here. It has a little di rubber diaphragm. That rubber diaphragm moves in and out the amount of pressure going through. Which in change goes to this little screw here and makes it so that your heater element will turn off allowing the boiler to cool and then it'll turn back on once the boiler goes down below a certain pressure. If you screw this down it's going to require more pressure for your heater element to disengage. If you unscrew it you're going to require less pressure for the heater element to disengage. Right now I have it set to turn off at about 1.25 bar which is exactly where I want it.